Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. After a year of dating, Teddy Wright, a star of Bachelor Nation, and her boyfriend Nicholas tied the married in Napa Valley, California. Wright told people on Monday, November 13, of exchanging vows in front of their 97 guests. It was really important to us that our wedding feel intimate, that everyone that was there was someone who was significant to us in our journey, either separately or as a couple. We decided to celebrate our love with friends and family over the weekend. Our wedding was everything we had dreamed it would be and so much more, a day we will remember for the rest of our lives, she continued. The Bachelor season 26 alum announced the couple's engagement on social media in April. Wright posted a video of the two on Instagram with a caption, So this is love. I am engaged and feel so blessed I get to spend forever with my best friend. I've been in tears for days now, and even now, it seems like a dream. Almost two months after departing from season 8 of Bachelor in Paradise, Wright had announced her new romance to the public. I apologize for being so absent, but I was really sick after getting COVID. Nevertheless, I'm back, the surgical unit nurse posted on Instagram stories in December 2022. What you missed during my break is as follows. I am still working, dancing with my adorable little boy, and maybe sharing other stuff later. In less than a week, Wright gave followers a behind-the-scenes look at her and Nicholas' romance on social media. My very first kiss of the year. The California native wrote, Happy New Year hashtag 2023, as the title for an Instagram video that had multiple cute exchanges between her and her ex-boyfriend. On Clayton Eftard's 26th season of The Bachelor, which aired in January 2022, Fans first got to know Wright. Wright was thrilled to meet Bachelor at Alum Andrew Spencer when he joined the eighth season of Big Brother after being eliminated in the seventh week of the ABC show. I think Andrew Spencer is cute, but I don't know him at all, Wright said in an exclusive interview with Us Weekly in March 2022. He seems to me to be the epitome of happiness. He's simply so happy when you see him, and I adore it. He's hilarious. I have a thing for a really gorgeous and witty guy. Wright left Paradise early because there was no love chemistry when she and Spencer, 28, first met in person on BP. I want to have children and get married. In an episode from October 2022, Wright stated, I want to go home, get over this, and find that person. I feel awful. I just want to leave right away. I understand that you wanted me to find love here, but I'm just not ready for that. I'd like to go. I'm not going to go in there and bid them all a fond farewell. Wright talked about how proud she was of herself for leaving a cruel atmosphere after leaving and finding Nicholas. Wright posted on Instagram, 1. Leaving cruel environments and people around me. 2. Sticking to my boundaries no matter how many times people in authority try to cross them. Looking forward to this new chapter and everything the rest of the year has in store. Teddy Wright, a former bachelor in paradise, is married. After learning the wonderful news, she posted on Instagram. They were barely engaged for around four months before they were married. Teddy Wright has tied the knot formally. Teddy Wright has a legal marriage. The former cast member of Bachelor in Paradise announced the news on social media. With the caption, Introducing, The Myers, she posted several pictures from their special day. Teddy has already changed her name to Teddy Myers on Instagram. This past weekend in Napa Valley, Teddy got married to Nicholas Myers. They informed people of every detail. The couple exchanged vows in front of 97 of their closest friends and family members. Whether they were traveling alone or together, 
They wanted to be certain that everything in attendance was significant to their journey. She mentioned that they wished for an intimate wedding. Teddy added that everyone celebrated their love, and the whole weekend turned into a party. Teddy and Nicholas decided to have a black and white wedding. Her favorite flower, peonies, were even available for her bouquet thanks to the amazing efforts of her florist. The blushing bride looked elegant and sensual in a white satin dress. She said that it gave her confidence and that she instantly knew it was the one. The first glance she had with Nicholas was the moment she would remember the most. They read each other their vows during this time. Their wonderful day involved their entire family. Teddy Wright added that their relatives participated in their wedding. Celebrant father-in-law of hers presided over the event. In addition, every sibling of the couple attended the wedding. It felt like seeing the love in the generations that came before us walking down the aisle before I walked down to my now husband. The sister remarked, so it was really special for us to have these roles. Teddy and Nicholas' guests joined them for a meal of steak and chicken following the ceremony. They all had a s'mores bar, vanilla cake, and lemon cake for dessert. Our wedding was everything we had dreamed it would be and so much more. A day we will remember for the rest of our lives, Teddy remarked. Congratulations to the joyful pair. For more information on all of your favorite Bachelor Nation stars, stay tuned. Formerly a husband and wife team. On season seven of Bachelor in Paradise, viewers of Bachelor Nation witnessed Mary Pepin and Kenny Brosh fall in love and get engaged. The two are now happily married, and we are very happy for them. Mary and Kenny exchanged vows in Hacienda Don Carmelo in Puerto Rico, her home, in front of 65 close family members. The couple said, I do believe in signs and numbers. So 11L events is obviously seen as a special number, and it means good things, in an interview with people regarding the date of their wedding. Mary looked gorgeous walking down the aisle in her Justin Alexander wedding gown. It was completely different from what I had envisioned before I was actually starting to plan everything, she said to the site. I went to try on dresses and I ended up getting the exact opposite thing that I had anticipated. During their first dance during their wedding, Mary and Kenny also gave an homage to their time spent in paradise together. As a tribute to the 1980s-themed prom, they went to together on Bachelor in Paradise. The couple decided to dance to Foreigner Song, I Want to Know What Love Is on their first dance as husband and wife. As a little girl, I always dreamed of my wedding day, and what's it going to look like, and what am I going to wear? But as you get older, you realize that that's not the important part. A tearful Mary said in an interview with the outlet about being married to Kenny. Finding someone you want to spend the rest of your life with, and who you get along with so well, is actually the important part, she continued. And it wasn't until I met Kenny that I realized... Oh yeah, this is the kind of person I want to be with. And I stopped worrying about that. That let me know it was the proper thing to do. Although their wedding day in Puerto Rico was a small celebration, Mary hinted to the publication that they are also organizing a larger event that will welcome members of their Bachelor Nation family. She said, We've always had the idea to do a couple of other celebrations so we can include more people as well in reference to their impending party in Chicago. We are thrilled for Mary and Kenny and are eager for the festivities to go on. Well done, newlyweds. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.